you have been through the Campbell McLean, Campbell two 0 win against Nielsen at Brigger League. Just give us your thoughts on the game. Uh, it was a tough game. Uh, pitch was actually good. The surface was alright. Very windy here, so we tried to get the ball in, but sometimes we had to clap into corners, and, and the wind was affecting it. But I thought first half was a battle, and then second half we really came into it, took the goal, and then after that it was a bit of a battle, and we killed it late on with second. Please, if you're set to get a second start in two weeks. It's good to good to start. Obviously, I train every Tuesday, so it's good being in with the boys, getting experience. But game experience is a lot different from training, and they've all helped me through it so far. I'm not going to get ahead of myself. I know there's so much hard work to be done, and don't get too high with the highs and too low with the lows. So I'm just going to keep working hard and taking any opportunity I'm given. Uh, the manager was very complimentary in his interview. Uh, he says you'll you'll keep the jersey for next week. You. Looking forward to the game against Ashfield? Well, it's up to me to prove it in training first. Uh, there's no such thing as a certainty, but it's great to hear words uh, like that from, from the gaffer. And the coaching staff here is, is brilliant with me and it's also my boys, so it's been a really good change for them to come into at such a young age and I'm just enjoying the experience at the moment. You've been playing in the under 20 so for most of the season, you've been the captain. How's the season been for yourself? Uh, personally, it's, it's been a good season. I, I, I feel like I've played well and getting the captaincy after Sam moved up was a was a big pride of mine and I've, I've really enjoyed doing that but I want to push myself and this is where I want to play, this is where I want to be the most but I'll just keep working hard and the Twitties, Twitties are a really good team we've, we've had some bad results but there's a good group of lads there really good, some really good players that will make careers in the game so it's been a really good foundation to build on in the first team now Cheers Cam, well done Thank you very much Boone, cheers with manager Chris Aitken. Chris, an important win, 2 0 win against uh, Nielsen here at Brigger League. Just give us your thoughts on the game. You're absolutely spot on, man. It's, it was an important win, that's what it was. It's three points, please think of the clean sheet. So when you get to this stage of the season, it's all about getting the three points, and today we've done that. We've talked before about playing against teams at the bottom of the table, but the players showed a lot of character to go and get the result today. Yeah, they did. I thought we started the game very well. I thought we were right in the front foot. Uh, and we had a few good chances, and then we took our foot off the gas a wee bit. We let them into it, and I said to them at half time, and then they go and try and try and get our noses in front. And we've done that with Mark's free kick, uh, and then we've finished it off. He's got another one. So, listen, it's always difficult when you come to these places. They're fighting for a lease, uh, and we knew it was going to be like that. But it was just, uh, it was good to get to get another three points on the board. Horrible conditions with the wind as well. The wind, wind played a big part. It did play a big part, and away for it for both teams. Uh, and, but it's, listen, it's something you just need to deal with, uh, and I thought we dealt with it well. Uh, and as I say, the big thing now is we've got seven seven cup finals to go, and we need to go and prepare for that. Um, you brought in Campbell McLean last week against the and another uh, good performance from him today. Campbell deserved to stay in the team today. It would have been easy for me to put Campbell out of the team today. Uh, with the four that came back, we were missing for the Trinent side, uh, Trinent game. But he deserved to stay in the team. And I told him that, I said that, and I've said that when I've stood in front of the camera. It doesn't matter if you're 18 or, or who you are in this team, if you come in and produce a good for me, you'll keep the jersey. And he'd done that today. And I just said to him here in front of the boys, he was outstanding today. So he'll, he'll be one again next week, he'll play next week regardless of what happens. Compared to that game next week, it's uh, Ashford at home. Listen, it's, we, we kind of get away from it at this stage of the season, we know exactly where we are. Uh, we know the teams that we're competing with and Ashford are one. So it's going to be a massive game next week at the Buffs Park, massive. Uh, we had a great support today and I just asked to come into numbers and back, and back them uh, next week because it's a huge, a huge game for the club. Cheers Chris.